Uh, hello everybody and welcome back to some Feed the Beast University. How you guys doing today? I hope you are doing well. I am. So, last episode, we got together and we done our ore miner. Dark outside. It's weird. Anywho, got this guy. He's been running. We've got some stuff. I've cleared some of this stuff out of here, but not all of it. Uh, stuff, the main ores that we're using right now. Um, outside of that, I have added uh, some barrels in here. Uh, this thing is spitting out eggs just left and right. We've got eggs galore. Um, we have, okay, he's not in there. Um, and then I have, you're going to notice, we've kind of seen it. I have done some cleaning up of stuff. All our chests are gone. Everything's gone. Uh, I went through and made a whole bunch of barrels. Got everything kind of sorted out, sort of. Uh, all the main stuff is in here. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, all of our main stuff is in here. Uh, and then some of the more random stuff I've got just... It's, it's sort of separated. Uh, it's a lot better than what it was. So, uh, and then I got these. We're going to be using these probably next episode uh, to work on uh, Mob Farm. Uh, also, this guy is almost filled up. And I'm going to tell you how I've done it. One. Uh, I have found uh, this guy right here has this got stuff in it. I don't want to use it. Um, we done the little ritual up here for uh, getting mana with the durability exchange. Uh, one real quick and easy way that I was doing this, uh, of course, one was getting the. Uh, I found a couple of those uh, dark steel swords. I was using those. Uh, the other way is we've got a bunch of nickel. Uh, I won't need two of these. We'll just make one. We can make shears. These have got fairly decent durability for what they are. And they're fairly cheap. Uh, we can throw that on here. And boom. Our thing is now filled up. So when we get ready to get back into more of that, we've got 10,000 mana. And our other mana is full, and these things are just about dead now. We'll just trash them. Alright, so, as far as today's bit of business, what are we going to do? Well, I want to get into... Oh, I did complete a quest. This quest right here, Barrel Controller, doesn't give us any reward. Uh, I've got that hooked up. We're going to have it hooked up for uh when we get ready to hook up our a e system which we're going to do soon in uh we're going to start working on some genetics reborn uh i want to get our way through this from what i understand we can get flight this way uh without having to grid power or anything like that so that is what we are going to work on uh, so, first things first, we need to make a metal scraper. Uh, this takes genes from mobs. Um, need to get organic matter from the mob. So, that is. Uh, I lost my page here. Um, easy enough. One, two, three. And one, two. Boop, 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 boop. There we go, metal scraper quest complete that didn't give us anything the other thing we're going to do need is a syringe uh this will be used to get blood from ourself uh this guy right here we're probably going to need a couple of these i know we had some pistons but the question is is what did i do with said piston aha we got one uh, I said I was going to do two of these. Let's get stuff together to do two of these. Uh, one of those. One of those. 
one of those. All right, so piston. There we go. That's taken care of. We need glass. I've got glass. Uh, one, two, three. Uh, that's all we needed is that. And now we should be able to make this guy right here. Oh, we need arrows. Uh, do I have any here? I do. So, two of those guys. Beautiful. Quest complete. Nothing. Uh, cloning machines. Uses a rather amount of RF to spawn a mob. Uh, we're not going to use it to... We're not going to spawn any mob with it. Uh, we need to make another scraper. Or two. Let's do that. Got that, that, and that. There is our scraper. And then now we just need to go ahead and start making the machines. So that's what I'm going to do right quick. I'm going to go ahead and make all of these machines. I don't think there's anything. Uh, we do need to get a sale. We'll have to figure that out. All right, so I'm going to make this guy and the other guy and get some power. We'll be back. Alright, so I got the cell analyzer. My guess is is we're going to go have to use our scraper on a mob. Now, I went to make um, this guy right here. Yeah, that ain't happening. At least right now. Um, so, we're going to skip that part. Uh, next up, we need a DNA extractor. We need to get a cell from that for that. So for the time being, let's just go find us a mob. Uh, actually, the best way to get a mob is to go upstairs to our mob farm. Oop. Uh, I think. Uh, let's turn it off. Let's do. I don't know which one would be good to do. Let's do that guy. Did I get anything from it? Not exactly sure. Ah, there we go. We got organic matter. Let's grab a few of these. Just to see what we get. Like I said, I don't know a whole lot about this mob mod. I've never used it. Alright, let's kill these guys. We're good. Ooh, we got another head. That's awesome. Alright, there's some more. Alright, let's go back downstairs. I don't know why I come down here. Because we could have just went out that door. All right, so let's throw one of those in there, uh, and let's see what we get. There is overclockers for this. I don't... Aha, overclockers. Actually, those aren't that bad. Uh, so that's a cell type for a creeper. Now, can I use that for... Our machine that we need which is the DNA extractor I need to make two more pistons all right so it does look like we can use that for that so there is our DNA extractor let's get this guy set up here let's get him some power and we need another matter uh i think i want to do let's do the creeper stuff um so this guy's gonna go let's give him a little speedy up juice 
that gives us the sale. And that gives us a gene of a creeper. That doesn't help us a whole lot, I don't think. We didn't get no quest. Uh, this wants us to make a overclocker. We need four cells. We can do that right quick. Let's go ahead and use those guys. All right, so overclocker. Pop. Boop. There's a clock. There is overclocker. Beautiful. Uh, now, let's see. This, of course, no quest. It says it can be installed. It doesn't tell us how much faster this is going to make the machines. Um, but we can find out right quick. One doesn't do a whole lot. So, we need to make a DNA encryptor. So, we need to get another helix. Uh, which we've got that being worked on right this minute. There we go, that one, he can go in there. Let's give it some speedy up juice. And there we go. Um, now this is where we're going to, no, no, we, we're, we're good, we're good. I'm, I'm short on slime. That's going to wind up being our issue here. If we have to make too many of these pistons. All right, so the decryptor. Uh, if we look at the quest, that tells us it will decrypt it and find its gene types. Gene types are essentially what power the, the gene gives. So, example, Milky gives the ability to be milked. I don't want to be milked. Uh, it, um, plasmids have gene types infused into them. Place the plasmid in the right slot. The DNA helix in the left. Uh, which can't be basic, is what chooses what gets infused. You must provide it with 24 points. Uh, yeah, this is... I have no idea. Um, so, plasmid infused, we need these, which is a whole bunch more of the helixes. So, I need to spend a minute and get a bunch of these going. All right, so I think I got everything together to make this guy. There we go. There is the plasmid infuser. This guy can go down right here. Let's give it some power. We'll take a look at it. All right, so... Um, let's go back... Plasmid in the right slot, and the DNA helix is in the left. Alright, I think I'm going to need some more stuff. Alright, so I'm slowly getting somewhere here. One of the things I was missing was this machine right here. Or, excuse me, this machine right here. Uh, the DNA crypto. We had it made. Uh, but basically, we take our DNA helixes that we got, we run them through here, and it will give us the traits of... The, the mob which that's running creeper stuff now it's not doing us a whole heck of a lot of good uh but i got basic genes and explosive exit from the creeper which that means when we die if we've got gunpowder on us we'll blow up uh and then we've got the ones from the skeleton which we got the basic gene and then we've also got infinity which means we can have a bow and not ever have to use any arrows uh, I am working on running through uh, the zombie one um, to see what we get out of it. Um, trying to see if we get... Now, I'm looking through all the different stuff that we can get, but I do not see flight for this. Um... But supposedly there is flight. So I am um, trying to figure this out. So I'm going to, that's just a basic gene. I'm going to mess around with it for a minute. Um, I do know 
we're trying to get to this guy, which that's got infinity on it now. Uh, we need to give it 24 infinity, I guess. In order for this to work. Uh, we get anything else? No, still basic. Uh, and then after that, it's going to be trying to find some... Uh, 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 yeah trying to find some bats to do that that's something that I'll probably wind up doing off camera uh, we have just about whoops oh by the way uh, I got the guardian found a guardian temple I went out looking for some uh, sea landers which we got somewhere I don't know what I did with them um, there are spots, if you look at the map, it's the wrong button, um, you can see, where's the spot, like right here, these are loaded down with just, it's just prismarine blocks, so I was hoping we could find, you know, mine a bunch of those and see if we could get sea lanterns from it, and we couldn't. So I couldn't do that. I went to another spot. And then I found this guardian temple. Grabbed the sea lanterns off the top of it. We're going to be using that uh, here pretty soon. There they are. Um, we're going to need it for our Batania building that we're going to do. Alright, so I did finally get another one from the zombies. We got resistance from it. Which that would necessarily be bad to have. Uh, but I think in order to test all this out so we can figure out exactly what all it is we're doing, we are going to work on trying to give ourselves uh, infinity. Uh, hopefully we can get enough out of this to do this. Um, so, first things first. One of the things we're going to need to do is, I guess, brick ourselves. Um, this blood is contaminated. This goes inside of the purifier there. This should purify our blood. With this, we should be able to mix it with this. Actually, no, well, let's not do that. I think if we have two, is that what that said? Uh, basic gene is worth one point, and a gene of the same type is worth two points. Or as the first, at gene is the same type as the first is worth two points. All right, maybe that's what that is. Um, let's do that. Let's grab these guys and see if we can throw them in here too. Uh, this should give us ten if I'm reading that right. Come on, come on, come on. We got stuff to do. Yep, alright. And those guys should just add one to it. But it shouldn't change our gene. That's what I'm hoping. Um, as long as that works, we're okay. We can get this. Yeah, that gives us just one. So we should be able, with what we've got here, be able to take care of this. All right, so we got our 24 of 24. So it's complete. Let's grab it. Let's grab our blood. And then we should be able to put that and that in here. All right, so we've got this guy. It is contaminated, so let's uncontaminate it again. And then we will see about giving ourselves infinity. Alright, so, uh, right click to draw blood, shift right click to inject blood. Bleeding, we've got blindness. But, we should have infinity now. So, if I come down here into... this guy we don't have a bow i don't have a bow we've got bows upstairs let's go grab one all right i have a bow 
Oh yeah. Wait. That looks like there's two. There is two. Alright, that's pretty cool. So now we never have to worry about carrying any arrows on us. Um so I'm gonna spend a minute here and I'm going to see about doing another one just to see what we can get. So I shall be back. Alright, so before I mess around with anything else, I'm gonna go ahead and make one of the last two things that we need to complete this chapter. The cloning machine we can't do until we get a nether star. We're still a bit away from that. Uh, the anti-plasmid, this is used for removing um, any gene that we don't want. Um, so there we go. That quest is complete. And we didn't get not a single um, thing from that. But the next... Uh, let me get rid of some stuff out of my inventory here right quick. The next one that I am going to work on is we can get extra hearts uh, if I have I do have a pumpkin uh, by doing this with a iron golem so that is what we're going to do I'm going to make us a iron golem we're going to put him up here for now Hopefully he doesn't tear me up for trying to take his blood. Why did that not work? Maybe we don't have... Oh, I got the pumpkin back. Maybe there's not enough room in here. Maybe we need to do this outside. Just so we got some space. All right, outside, we'll put him up here. That way we can kind of keep an eye on him. And he doesn't just wander off everywhere. And he doesn't trample our crops or anything like that. Beautiful. All right, we've got him. Let's get us... a bunch of his DNA. I'm going to get as much of this as I can. Uh, that one's done. I mean, we got, uh, we got a bunch. That'll work. Oh, Lord. Oh, he's going to wind up going upstairs. Um, I should probably kill him. Uh, no, not yet. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's just hope he doesn't go upstairs. Oh, wait, he's not going to teleport because he doesn't have mana. All right, I'm going to do this. Uh, this zombie stuff, uh, I may go ahead and work on getting uh, some resistance, too. I'll be back. All right, so we've got last syringe. It has infinity because we have infinity, and then we've got resistance. Shift, right-click, boom. We should now have resistance, too. Beautiful. Yeah. Now I am just waiting on these guys to finish. All right, we're back. I got our first set here for this, uh, which is not that one. Where did I? This right here. More hearts. Uh, the Iron Golem actually gives us two. It gives us more hearts, and it's also got regen so we are going to be giving ourselves both these there we go do that throw this up in here there we go and boom we got more hearts they give us a whole another set of hearts now what I don't know, and I'm trying to find out, is if these will stack. We may try that just to see if it does. Um, but first, we're going to get this guy. That won't take but a minute to fill this guy up. Let's get us some more blood going. 
That is complete. Uh, and then once I do this, I will throw together the stuff for some more hearts. And we'll see if that'll work. Uh, that needs to be contain or uncontaminated. Now, if we could just get one for saturation, I would love it. Uh, all right, so shift right click, boom. We now have regen. Beautiful. That's awesome. All right, I'm going to try this whole more hearts thing right quick. All right, so to answer the question myself, no, it will not add this to it. We can hold on to that. We'll just throw it over here. Now we got a full one of those and a full one of those. Uh, yeah. All right. So, um, before we go, there's going to be one more quest I'm going to wind up completing. Uh, extra utilities. We've got this guy open. Let's go ahead and make it. Uh, because I'm going to be using it to go get a bat and going to see about getting us some flight between now and the next episode um so but with that that's all i've got time for um so uh thank you guys for watching uh well yeah wait no is that, is that was that it i'm gonna make sure i got everything completed here before we do this uh that needs that we haven't got a the other one yet so yeah so hope you guys enjoyed the episode i thank you for watching and i will see you guys next time bye